Hello friends. So it is now Wednesday, the third week in Lent, and the title for our devotion is Greedy or Grateful. Proverbs 30, 8 and 9 says, dot, dot, dot. Go get your Bible. Press pause. Look it up. Press play again. Give me neither poverty nor riches. Feed me with the food that I need, or I shall be full and deny you and say, who is the Lord? Hmm. Can I have two scoops of ice cream instead of just one? Owen asked his mom. Greedy or grateful? His mom asked. Hmm, greedy. But can I still have two scoops? When we need something or greedily want more, we readily think to ask God for it. But when life is good and things seem easy, we can sometimes forget to spend time with him in gratitude. King Solomon was wise enough to know this. That's why in Proverbs 30, he asked God to make him neither rich nor poor. He knew that if he had too much, he might forget about God. He also knew that if he were destitute, he might take wrong actions out of desperation and end up offending God. The antidote to both fears is gratitude. If we constantly stop and recognize what God has given us, we won't be focusing on the things we don't have. If we then give him thanks for all those blessings, they seem to multiply and be more than enough. Let's pray. Dear God, may we always focus on what we do have and not on what we don't. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Amen. Okay, my friends, and now here is our awesome challenge. It says, make a list of all the ways you have been blessed. Hang your list on the refrigerator to remind you to always be grateful. I love this so much. My husband and I have been making lists lately. And so this is one of those things that falls right in line with what we have already been doing. I love it. Okay, my friends, I will see you tomorrow. Bye.